Welcome back to my channel during King Mass. In this video, we are going to solve this nice exponential equation that says find the value of t where 2 to the power of t equals t to the power of 32. To start the solution, I'm going to raise both sides to the power of 1 over t. So it is going to be left side we have 2 to the power of t, raise it to the power of 1 over t, right side t to the power of 32 raise it to the power of 1 over t. To continue the solution, I'm going to get help from this exponential rule that says a to the power of m raised to the power of n is same as a to the power of m times n. So our left hand side is going to be, I write the base first exponent times second exponent equals our right hand side I write the base first exponent times the second exponent so let's see what is this left hand side I write 2 as the base this t this t can be cancelled off so right hand side t our base 32 over t Until here, we have both variable terms in one side. Now, I'm going to remove this 32 from right side and transpose it to the left side to have both constant term left side. So it is going to be, how can we do this? To do this, we are going to raise both sides to the power of 1 over 32. So it is going to be left side 2 raised to the power of 1 over 32 equals right side we have t to the power of 32 over t raised to the power of 1 over 32 so what is this left side no change write it 2 to the power of 1 over 32 right side it is going to be t to the power of first exponent which means 32 over t times second exponent 1 over 32 until here what do we have it is same as left hand side no change 2 to the power of 1 over 32 right right side we have t as the base this 32 this 32 can be cancelled off so we have 1 over t as our exponent look what do we have here we have both variable terms right side, both constant term left side. And what is interesting here, right hand side we have t to the power of 1 over t, which means a number to the power of 1 over that number. What a beautiful structure. If we make this form for our left hand side, so we can solve this equation easily. But how can we do this? Look. If we are going to make this form for our left hand side, we need to work on this exponent, which means 1 over 32. Let me write it here, 1 over 32. What is this? It can be written in the form of 1 times 1 over 32, right? Same. 1 times 1 over 32 is 1 over 32. What is 1? 1 can be written in the form of 1 over 1, 2 over 2. 5 over 5 or numbers over that number okay so i write it in the form of 2 over 2 times 1 over 32 so 1 over 32 is same as 2 times 2 over 2 times 1 over 32 so what is our next step look as a next step i write here we have 2 instead of 1 over 32 i write 2 over 2 times 1 over 32 our left hand side right hand side no change t over 1 over t next step look i write this base 2 2 over 2 i write this 2 times i transpose this 2 here so it is going to be 2 times 32 so it is 2 times 1 over 2 times 32, right? 
2 over 2 times 1 over 32 is same as 2 times 1 over 2 times 32. This is our left hand side. What do we have? Right hand side, t over 1 over t. What is our next step? Look, how can we continue? We have 2, I write it here. 2 times 1 over 2 times 32 or 1 over 64 equals right side t over 1 over t what is this look a to the power of m times n we have a to the power of m times n how can we convert it to next form it can be written in the form of a to the power of m raised to the power of n so this one can be written in the form of our left hand side we have 2 right to the power of these 2 raised to the power of 1 over 64 equals right side t to the power of 1 over t so 2 to the power of 2 is 4 to the power of 1 over 64 equals t to the power of 1 over t still it is not in the form of a number to the power of one over that number so we need to continue this job until we get this form now one over 64 exactly like last step can be written in the form of two over two times one over 64 so our left hand side is going to be let me write it here four to the power of two over two times 1 over 64 right hand side t to the power of 1 over t so what is this it can be written in the form of 4 to the power of these two times 1 over these two times 64 this is our left hand side right hand side t to the power of 1 over t what is this it is going to be 4 to the power of these 2 times 1 over 2 times 64 is 1, 2, 8. Our left hand side equals right hand side t to the power of 1 over t. So 4 to the power of 2 times 1 over 20, uh, 128 can be written in the form of 4 to the power of 2 raised to the power of 1 over 128 our left hand side right hand side t to the power of 1 over t okay what is this so it is going to be 4 to the power of 2 16 right to the power of 1 over 128 our left hand side equals right hand side t to the power of 1 over until here we have this one good job but still it is not in the form of something to the power of one over that one so we need to continue this one over 128 can be written in the form of two over two times one over 128 so i rewrite our left hand side in the form of 16 to the power of two times 1 over 2 times 128 our left hand side right hand side t to the power of 1 over t what is this this is exactly in the form of 16 to the power of 2 raised to the power of 1 over 2 times 128 is 256 this is our left hand side right hand side we have t to the power of 1 over t right until here what do we have here our left hand side 16 to the power of 2 is 256 raised to the power of 1 over 256 equals right hand side t to the power of 1 over t look this one carefully compare left hand side and right hand side our left hand side equals our right hand side also our left hand side now is a number to the power of one over that number 
also right hand side a number to the power of one over that number so if we compare these two sides together it will be super easy to find the value of t which means t equals 256 and this is our final answer have fun